Fishing tournaments are a great way to introduce kids to the sport of fishing, and they're even better when they bring awareness to a worthy cause. This is the third annual Kids Catch All Fishing Tournament held at Indian River Marina in Delaware Seashore State Park. The children can fish by boat, um, by jetty, on the beach, off their dock, wherever they'd like, as long as they bring the fish here to be weighed in. Kids can fish one or both days of the weekend, and because of the conditions, they're gonna need to put as much time in as possible. This dumb weather. <laughs> I guess that's fishing though, right? You can't help it. Yeah. Would you rather be sitting inside? No! No. How come? Because he's getting outside, enjoying the freaking breeze. That breeze made fishing difficult on Saturday, but on Sunday it was pretty nice, and that means fish are coming into the scales. Three triggers and one kingfish. Oh, they did great. They, yeah. they, they tried real hard, and uh, we caught a few, so we enjoyed it. Two pounds, five ounces. Woo! Here we go. There may not be any monsters coming into the marina, but the kids are having a good time, even though some may not necessarily enjoy posing with their fish. <laughs> Only because it's your uncle. Oh, you got the How come you weren't holding your fish? Because they don't like holding fish. They don't like holding, <laughs> don't like holding fish. <laughs> no. I'll hold her fish. How come? Hold. Because they're slimy. <laughs> slimy fish aside, the headline of the Kids Catch All Fishing Tournament is where the proceeds go. It raises money for the Lyme Disease Association for our educational efforts. And if you've been outside even the least little bit over the last few months, there's a good chance you've had to remove a tick or two. All of the ticks on the Delmarva Peninsula are carrying diseases. So every single tick that you have on you, you wanna be aware of. And some of the latest studies have found that ticks can transmit disease in just a few minutes. So you want to do everything you can to keep ticks off of you. There's been some great studies that found that if you'll just treat your shoes with permethrin, it'll help keep ticks off of you. 17-year-old Kelsey Warren proves just how devastating a tick bite can be. Um, about three years ago, I got bit and got really sick. And um, it's caused me to not be able to walk. And I started out with a cold, and the symptoms continued to get worse. And we found out that it was Lyme. This time last year, I was completely bedridden. And now I can go out and do things. And I'm starting to be able to walk again. It's been rough. I was pretty active before this happened, but I have a lot of support and I'm really blessed that that's what's kept me going. <laughs> Although there may not be any ticks on the water, the Kids Catch All Fishing Tournament is not taking any chances. The key is, is to do tick checks all day long if you're going to be outside on yourself, your kids, and your pets. Make sure you spray down good before you go out and check when you come back in. They are doing their part to make sure that everyone on Delmarva is aware of the dangers these tiny ticks can carry with them.